To get the most out of your Honeywell Quiet Set Tower Fan, follow these helpful steps. Available with five or eight settings, the Quiet Set controls allow you to adjust the fan setting to meet your sound and cooling needs. Choose sleep or calm settings to enjoy the cooling effects with less noise. The Power Cool setting provides the highest airflow and maximum cooling power. Press the oscillation button for air circulation throughout the room. Adjusting your settings from anywhere in the room is easy using the fan's accompanying remote control. Use the Quiet Set fan with your central heating and cooling system to help save on your electricity bill year round. Need a fan to fall asleep but don't want it on all night? Set the auto shut off timer to turn your fan off after one, two, four, or eight hours. Depending on your model, lighting from the fan will automatically dim or the lights can be dimmed manually with a choice of five different light levels. The slim design is sturdy and powerful enough to circulate air throughout a medium to large room and is easy to store when not in use. To assemble, first click the two base halves together, then remove the locking nut from the bottom of the fan housing. Thread the cord through the base and place the fan housing into the base. Thread the cord once again through the locking nut, twist the locking nut onto the base until you hear an audible click. For cord management, slide the cord through the inside guide tabs and out through the bottom. Replace the thumb screws for added stability, stand your fan up, and it's ready for use. For a powerful tower fan, try the Honeywell Quiet Set Tower Fan. For more information about Honeywell fans, visit HoneywellPluggedIn.com. Hi, I'm Jamie Simonoff, inventor of the Ring Video Doorbell. Ring Video Doorbell lets you see and speak to visitors from anywhere using your smartphone. I just want to show you how quick and easy it is to install it. First, just go to the App Store, search for Ring, and download the app. Now that the app is installed, just open it, click on Set Up a Device, and Ring will walk you through the setup process. Now let's set up your Ring. You'll notice when you open the box that all the tools are included for installation. Just grab your ring and now pair it to the phone. So I'm going to call this one front door. It's going to show you which address you're at. Hit continue. And now just hit the orange button on the back of the ring. You'll notice that the white lights start. That means it's in pairing mode. All you're going to do is put in your network address, your password. Okay. And now the ring is pairing to your network. Now that the ring device is paired, let's grab the box with all the tools and head outside. Okay, so the first thing you want to do, take the included screwdriver and take off your existing doorbell. So now just detach the wires and we're going to put those on the bracket. Now just take the included level, snap it on the bracket, put it on the wall, get it level and start screwing it in. So once you finish screwing in the bracket and securing it on the wall, now it's time to install the wires. Just back off these screws, put the wire around it, screw it back on, and now you have power to the ring. All to do is just pop the ring on and put on the security screws using the security side of the screwdriver. And now your ring is installed. With ring, you're always home. <laughs>